All right, so through here, you can see some of our famous projects from YouTube. We got the Captain America electromagnet bracer down there, the Doom Fist, the Chain Fist. This is the Proto Saber battery pack, a whole bunch of Thor hammers, the umbrella from Kingsman, a Shazam staff, the skull hammer, and the RuneScape sword. So we've been busy. My name is James Hobson. I'm here in Kitchener, Ontario. I'm 29 years old. I have a bachelor's degree in mechanical systems engineering, and four years ago, I quit my full-time job as an engineer to pursue YouTube full-time. I'm the Hacksmith, and we just finished building a Batman grappling hook and repelling device. The Make It Real is our main series on YouTube, and we take fictional ideas from comics, movies, and video games and make real working prototypes. And we do this as a way to inspire youth into science, technology, engineering, and math, and basically show how cool it is to be an engineer. I made these claws 10 years ago now, and it was quite literally my very first Make It Real project. It didn't get very many views at first until I ran electricity through them. And then I basically made like a Jacob's Ladder between two and I was able to cut through things and suddenly people took notice and I got a whole bunch of uh, news headlines being like, crazy engineer electrifies Wolverine's claws. So that's also when I kind of realized like, oh, you kind of got to like uh, spice things up to get the internet to notice. Me? Holy crap. That, this is, oh, it is so hot. Like my face is starting to burn. Ever since I was a kid, I've enjoyed building things. And I always gravitated towards tech class, and I eventually went to school to become an engineer because an engineer has the ability to make and design pretty much anything, which I think is the dream job. Let's laser a banana. So I started producing weekly content in 2012 and I did that while I was working in various engineering jobs and not much happened. I maybe gained a few thousand subscribers and I was making maybe 10 bucks a month. So it wasn't really going anywhere, but then I had a few projects that got some more interest. James Hobson is only 24 years old, but he's already designing and building technology usually only seen in movies. He hopes one day it'll help save lives. You could be able to go in and say, pull wreckage off of a person, something you probably wouldn't be able to do normally. So that was our first successful video on YouTube. Um, that was based off the movie Elysium with Matt Damon. And suddenly it was just like, hey, there's, there's appetite for this online. Maybe I, can, maybe I can do this more. I'm pretty excited. I think this is gonna work out quite well. I asked if I could work part-time so I could uh, focus more on YouTube. And they're like, no, we can't make any exceptions. So I handed in my resignation letter the next day. A lot of my coworkers thought I was pretty crazy for uh, quitting my job because it was a well-paying engineering job, great company, but it wasn't what I wanted to do. I wanted to do YouTube full-time. All right, so this is the original Captain America shield that really started the channel. The next year, I had my first like super viral project, and that's when we made the Captain America electromagnet shield. So we webbed together a prototype, we did a build video, a test video, and both videos got millions of views in a month, and the channel grew from 100,000 subscribers to half a million, and suddenly I was like, whoa, we're a mid-sized channel now, like, it's working. Since then, we've been doubling year over year in size, subscribers, and employees, too. Oh, yeah! Now who's laughing? <laughs> So this is a new home of Hacksmith Industries. On the right, we have our video editing pod. Got my office over here. It's a little messy right now. But the real magic and the real reason I got this place is behind this door. <music> 10,000 square feet with 20 foot ceilings. The room to pretty much make or do anything you want. Over here we have some of our fun toys, some of the, uh, the company motorcycles, and under this is our MGB spy car. 
We're making a James Bond spy car, complete with ejection seat, rockets under the headlights. We have a few dream projects that we're currently working on. One of them is the Aliens power loader. So we're actually making the, the yellow walking forklift from uh, Aliens 2. It's been out for 40 years, no one's ever done it, but the cool thing is it's actually possible. And then following that, obviously, is some kind of Iron Man suit would be a dream project of ours. Were you expecting someone else? In the meantime, we like doing quick and easy projects like building a half-scale Cybertruck, which my team's working on right now. And then we're gonna fill up these tacks over there, and then we should be able to drop this on top and align the body. Because the Cybertruck is basically a giant polygon, we can literally plasma cut the pieces, weld them together, and bam, we have a Cybertruck. And it's gonna be able to tow stuff, like it's gonna have a lot of power. We're trying to knock that out in just two weeks, which is pretty cool, I think. Then through here, we have unit three because 10,000 square feet wasn't enough, so we rented the unit next door as well. Obviously, I could have kept the YouTube channel right here in this garage, keep a small team, and we could, we could still be growing huge on YouTube, but I wanted to really take this to the next level, and my dream is to actually try and turn this company into basically a real-life Stark Industries. So this is the ultimate sleeping pod. It's insulated from sound, it's got air conditioning and heating. We've got a temperature control here, we've got a USB ports and plugs inside, and basically you can have a great nap in there. <laughs> and we've actually had YouTubers stay in here, which is kind of cool. <laughs> and of course, you can uh, lock people in with a keypad. I'd love to make something that helps improve the quality of life for people. We can either live in the system or we can break through the system and create something new. So I see that as building this big company and being able to actually make a difference in the world. Because the, the fact of the matter is you need to build a team around you, you need to build a company around you. You'll actually have an impact on the world and that's, that's really what I want to do. Whenever we do a fan event and we have kids come up to meet us, it's always so amazing to hear like, I didn't know what engineering was and now like I'm halfway through engineering school or I made this thing because I saw your video. It's just, it's an awesome feeling. I just love how as an engineer, it's possible to take some of those things that like kids dream about and actually be able to do it. I can't think of a better job than, than this. Hacksmith Industries is the coolest thing we've ever made. You always had such great hair. <laughs> <laughs> I just push it back in the morning and it's good to go. Is that it? You don't, yeah. you don't There's do sometimes it? a little spray, but like, yeah. He's rolled that, out of bed just, like it's, it's, it's yeah. good hair. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. She also got hair. <laughs>